Hey guys, Brandon here. I am the director of all things photo and video at Scotch and Ramen. Basically, I just wanted to sit down and talk to you guys about, um, you know, what camera or gear should you buy? Uh, you know, whether you're starting out or maybe you have a little bit of experience and you just want to up your game. Um, really, the, the general rule of thumb you should always go by is the best camera is the one you have with you. I'm here at a beautiful lake in Banff. Um, if the only camera I had with me was my cell phone, then that's, you know, that is the best camera that I could use. Um, because that's the one that's going to get the shot right now. Um, I'm shooting this video on a Sony mirrorless camera. Um, that's sort of a middle of the road, um, around a thousand dollars. Um, and you know, that, that would kind of be more for, uh, you know, if you just want to up your game a little bit, maybe get into some, um, hobbyist yet, uh, you know, some client video. Um, you know, you can do a lot of really good things with, with a $1,000 or, or less than that, um, video camera. And then if, you know, if you're doing really high end shoots where there's lots of people and production involved, you're going to want to be using a higher end film camera, um, something like an RE or, or a RED. Um, you know, but for starting out, if you just want to get started on YouTube or vlogging, I mean, your phone is definitely the, the best camera to start out with. Chances are you already have one. So if you don't really have a budget to get into video or to spend on lenses, um, to start off with that, um, some of the biggest YouTubers and creators out there have started with the built-in webcam on their laptop and uploaded that to YouTube. Um, so, you know, it's all about what you have access to and what can tell your story. Um, most times a cell phone or, you know, a, a simple point and shoot camera can tell your story, but eventually you might grow out of that and want to, you know, pursue uh, photography or video um, more in, in your day-to-day -day life or in your professional life. And that's where you may want to upgrade to um, a DSLR or something along those lines. But bottom of the line, um, best camera is the one you have with you.